Has, uh, has everyone ever gone through the childhood where you know you have pictures of your life and you have instance like age one, age two, age three, all the way up to age fifteen? Well, I think this was me at age three, and that was my neighbor. You know, I was that devilish kid. I used to throw bricks and stones and whatnot into his house, and uh, he'd be like, "Exactly." I was a dog in this case, just to know which side I'm on. I was a dog, and what looks like is. An omelet with chocolates. <laughs> oh, it's something else that I don't want to say because people are really incorrect. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it's a harsh life. People get beat. It's, it's painful, but I'm not going down the memory lane again. And I obviously had my tongue sticking out like that. Except without the drool. So. And uh, obviously, my neighbor crying over his, I mean, I actually hit her son on the head, so he was hospitalized for a month. And uh, brain damage was there, but okay. Yeah. Okay, for the rest of this uh, contest now, right. you can use the word sit with the H or you can say doggy do. Okay. You can't use the word, the actual word. You can say sit with the H. The H, okay. Yeah. Or doggy do. Doggy do. Yeah. Alright. So since you were the dog, why did you do? I <laughs> did. Why? Was the question? Why did you do? What did I do? Where well, I get the structures? <laughs> you have to answer the question. That's it. Right. So, uh, from whatever you said, I summarized that I've seen sit as hit and doggy do. If that didn't make any sense, okay, fine. Why don't you do the new now? The new now? New now. New now. <laughs> do the new now. <laughs> do the new now. Okay, uh, why are you so crazy about omelet and chocolate? Is it thriving? Uh, yeah, I mean, I love omelets and chocolates. It's, my mom made it once and uh, she was experimenting with food, right? So, I'm the... Did she do that because you were weird or...? Yeah, but, but did I mention that when I actually hit the ball on her head, I got hit back? So, a little, you know, infection defect. So. Okay, how many idiots does it take to make an omelet? <laughs> One. Are you sure? Yeah. My experience or...? Yes. <laughs> How do you differentiate between idiot and a genius? Uh, it's a fine line thing. You know, it's, uh, it's look in the mirror and you can answer that. Apparently, uh, you don't know which side of the fine line you're on. For the simple reason that you don't know the difference between chocolate and doggy do. Please explain. Doggy do. Oh, okay, I got it right now. <laughs> Why did you get it now? <laughs> you know, I didn't get it. I was thinking Scooby Doo. So. <laughs> it's all got to do with the tube light. Huh? Pardon me? It's all got to do with the tube light. Yeah, there's a fine line between idiot and genius. So I guess I was on that side for now. Okay, if you had a girlfriend. I don't. How would you explain that you don't know the difference between what you said first and what you said second? Um, if I had a girlfriend, How she... Do you yeah, if I had a girlfriend, she'd know that I'm not an idiot, so she wouldn't exactly <laughs> expect an answer. <laughs>